A family can finally start the healing process after their daughter was killed by a drunk driver. Sophie Grace, just six months old. Look at those pictures. She died in 2018. The driver, Randy Till, got behind the wheel after drinking at a Jags game. Today, he was sentenced to be in prison for more than a decade, not without making an apology to the victim's family. On your side, Tristan Hardy has this story from Clay County. In this Clay County courtroom, two families are hurting. On one side, the family of six-month-old Sophie Grace is seeking justice. Judge Sherrod, I respectfully request that you sentence Mr. Randy Teal to a full and maximum sentence. While on the other, Randy Teal's family is asking for mercy. Forgive my son. Give him a second chance. This is the first mistake he ever made. This was the last picture taken of little Sophie. This, this baby right here. Sophie Grace, she's what keeps us going. On December 16, 2018, Randy Till was leaving a Jags game. He was driving nearly 60 miles per hour when he hit a car sitting at a red light. Sophie's mother was in the front while the six month old was in the back seat. Till was driving under the influence. Not why would God let this happen? Why did Randy Till make this happen? Till was facing 28 years in prison. Instead, Judge Michael Sherrod sentenced him to 14 years. To share it, Teal expressed regret and remorse for his actions. I am truly, from the bottom of my heart, apologize. I'm sorry, I am 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 sorry. Rebecca Friesenhan, Sophie's grandmother, believes Teal's apology was heartfelt. It has been such a hard day that I just, I'm, I'm, I'm numb. Like I have, I, I have no emotion left anymore. But forgiving him will take time. In Clay County, Tristan Hardy, First Coast News, on your side. Just sad all the way around. Tristan, thank you.